Okay. Let's just, um, let's just calm down a little bit. I'm just gonna throw out my two cents here because I, 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 I'm stunned. I'm so excited. I am a super fan. If anyone has ever followed me on my channel, you know, every chance I get, I will say Streets of Rage is the best. It's the best series ever. Streets of Rage 2 is the greatest game of all time. And I've just complained on social media. I complain in my own videos that uh, I wish they would just bring it back. And here we go. We've got confirmation that Streets of Rage 4 is being made as we speak. Now I'm just going to read you some of the press kit here. Uh, featuring hand-drawn visuals from the team behind 2017's gorgeous Wonder Boy The Dragon's Trap remake. Yes, you might recall that. That's the old Sega remake and it's beautiful. What you could do is you could switch between retro look and uh, the hand-drawn look and it's amazing. It's really beautiful. That's the team that's looking after this and as you can tell it does have that hand-drawn look and it looks great here too. Now let's get down to the nitty-gritty. Let's have a look. Let's go all the way back and let's just have a look at some of these things. Now, the first thing you're going to notice is Axel. He's a little bit older, he's a little bit more rugged, he's got this beard thing going on and it looks pretty cool. Now this is obviously not gameplay, this is just a short animated clip and as you can see, he is taking on Big Ben and Galsia. Then we're going to see one of those really annoying Noras being thrown into the wall and we turn around and who is revealed? But none other than Blaze Fielding. And this is where we get our first glimpse of actual gameplay. And this is Blaze, she does a jump kick into Y signal, Y standing for yellow. And incoming is Raven, the kickboxer, and looks like another Galsia. And this one's out on the streets during the daytime. Now we're getting our first glimpse of Axel actually fighting. He's fighting against Big Ben and Galsia, just like he was in that animated short. And it looks like he's inside an office building or something. Now we get our first glimpse of two-player mode, that's good to know, at least we know it's in there. Now they're doing some of their special moves and it's another street setting, this time at night time. Axel's taken on Big Ben and Galsia again. And Blaze has taken on Nora and here comes that yellow signal coming in to get her. Now we get our first glimpse of a new enemy. This one here being a female with a snake. Now we don't really know the context of this, we don't know if she's the main boss, I, I doubt she would be. But, you know, why would they give her all this screen time? Maybe it's just a character reveal, maybe it's just, hey look, we've got a new character, here you go. Now there's something else too here, I had a quick look at the key art here and if you look really closely at the paper money, the dollars flapping around in the wind here, it looks like you can see Mr. X's face. I don't know if I'm reaching here, I don't know if this is just wishful thinking, but it really does look like Mr. X. I don't know if he's alive, maybe he's just, uh, this is just in memory of Mr. X, but I'm pretty sure he'll be back. But uh, there we go. Now we don't know anything else other than what they've shown in the trailer. They haven't announced any systems yet. They haven't announced a date or a price or anything like that. But fingers crossed it's coming to any system that you own because, well, you know, we all want to play it. Well, I do. I'm hoping for Switch. Fingers crossed Switch. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Jeez, I'm so excited. <laughs> Thanks again. See you later.